Did OpenAI achieve artificial general intelligence? This question has recently catapulted into the spotlight. Following a series of dramatic events at OpenAI, the forefront organization in AI research. At the center of this unfolding story is Sam Altman, OpenAI's CEO, whose brief exile and subsequent return have stirred significant internal and industry-wide attention. Adding to the intrigue, a group of OpenAI staff researchers penned a cautionary letter to the board of directors, alerting them to a new AI discovery named QSTAR which they feared could pose a threat to humanity. This letter was a key factor in the board's decision to initially oust Altman, sparking a revolt amongst employees and culminating in over 700 staff members threatening to leave for Microsoft. But what exactly is QSTAR? How did it become a point of contention and concern among the brightest minds at OpenAI? And what does it truly mean to achieve Artificial General Intelligence, or AGI? By the end of this video, not only will you have answers to these pressing questions, but you will also gain a deeper understanding of the implications of reaching true AGI, and how it could transform our world. What is OpenAI's QSTAR? QSTAR represents a groundbreaking development in the domain of AGI which is the pursuit of creating autonomous systems capable of performing tasks that would normally require human intelligence. The project has garnered attention due to its potential implications for the future of AI technology. While specific details about QSTAR's functionality and capabilities are not fully disclosed, it is known that QSTAR has shown promise in solving mathematical problems at a level comparable to grade school students. This achievement, albeit seemingly modest, is a significant step in AI development. It suggests that QSTAR is capable of understanding and executing tasks that require a form of cognitive processing similar to human thought patterns. Why did OpenAI fire their CEO, Sam Altman? Sam Altman, the company's CEO and arguably the most important person in the race to develop Artificial General Intelligence, or AGI, was fired by OpenAI's nonprofit board, which, although details are still sketchy, was concerned that Altman was not moving cautiously enough in light of the dangers that AI could pose to society. But the board's actions appear to have backfired badly. No sooner was Altman fired than Microsoft, which has a close partnership with OpenAI, announced his hiring to head an internal Microsoft AI research division. And in the face of a near-total revolt by OpenAI's employees, the board ultimately agreed to hire Altman back as CEO, with several of the members who fired him in the first place resigning. There was a letter written by some of OpenAI's staff researchers to the board of directors. This wasn't just any ordinary letter. It contained a serious warning about the risks associated with a powerful AI discovery they were working on, which we believe is related to QSTAR. Think about it. These are the people actually hands-on with the technology, and if they're raising an alarm, it suggests there's something pretty significant about QSTAR's capabilities that we should all perhaps be a bit mindful of. Now, let's talk about the commercialization aspect. It's a bit of a tightrope walk, isn't it? On one side, you've got this incredible potential to revolutionize, well, just about everything with AI. On the other, there's this need to really understand what you're dealing with before you unleash it into the world. It seems that for the board at OpenAI, this balance might have tilted towards caution. They appeared concerned about moving too fast with QSTAR and its ilk, which is understandable. After all, once the AI genie is out of the bottle, it's pretty hard to put back. What happens if AGI is achieved? If OpenAI or any other company manages to achieve Artificial General Intelligence, or AGI, we're looking at a game changer. A real leap into the future kind of moment. Let's talk about what this could actually mean for us, in a real, down-to-earth way. The Positive Outcomes Number 1. Problem Solving and Innovation AGI could provide solutions to some of the most complex and persistent problems facing humanity, like climate change, 
disease, and poverty. Its ability to process and analyze vast amounts of data could lead to groundbreaking discoveries in various fields. Number 2. Efficiency and Productivity With AGI, industries and businesses could operate with unprecedented efficiency. It could take over repetitive and labor-intensive tasks, allowing humans to focus on more creative and strategic activities. Number 3. Personalized Services From education to healthcare, AGI could offer highly personalized services, adapting to individual needs and preferences, potentially improving the quality of life for many. Number 4. Global Connectivity and Understanding AGI could overcome language barriers and cultural gaps, fostering global communication and understanding. The Negative Consequences Number 1. Total Job Displacement One of the most significant concerns is the potential for massive job displacement. AGI could automate a wide range of jobs, leading to massive unemployment and economic instability. Number 2. Ethical and Moral Dilemmas AGI would pose complex ethical questions, such as decision-making in life-and-death situations, privacy concerns, and the potential for bias in AI systems. Number 3. Security Risks The power of AGI could also be misused, leading to new forms of cyber threats, surveillance, and even autonomous weapons. Number 4. Loss of Human Skills and Dependence there is a risk that over-reliance on AGI could lead to the atrophy of certain human skills and a significant dependence on technology for everyday tasks. Number 5. Control and Regulation Ensuring that AGI remains under control and is used ethically and responsibly is a significant challenge. The development of AGI could lead to power imbalances and require robust international regulatory frameworks. As you can see, the arrival of AGI would undoubtedly be a turning point in human history. While it offers extraordinary potential benefits, it also brings significant risks and challenges. So is QSTAR a breakthrough or a serious threat? The discussion around Artificial General Intelligence or AGI is incredibly rich and varied from a philosophical standpoint. Let's explore this from different angles. Starting with the transhumanist, they see AGI as a massive breakthrough. Their argument is that AGI can help us overcome human limitations and solve many of our big problems. It's like having a super intelligent ally to enhance our abilities and tackle issues we can't handle alone. However, there is a flip side to this coin. Many people, including experts in the field, are really worried about the existential risks AGI poses. They argue that if an AGI's goals don't align with human values, the results could be disastrous, maybe even threatening our existence. It's a bit like opening Pandora's box. Once it's open, there's no going back. Then there's the idea of technological determinism, which is fascinating. This perspective says that the development of AGI is inevitable, like it's a natural step in our technological evolution. From this viewpoint, the focus shifts to how we adapt to and govern this change, rather than whether we should develop AGI in the first place. Now, let's dive into the realm of AI ethics. This is where things get really intriguing. The question here is about the moral status of AGI. Should they have rights? How do we treat an intelligent entity that's not human? This brings up all sorts of questions about consciousness, rights, and what it means to be a moral agent. We also need to consider the social and political implications. AGI's impact could be shaped by the social and economic structures we have in place. There is a worry that AGI might worsen inequalities or create new forms of exploitation, especially if it's controlled by a select few. So this perspective really zooms in on the power dynamics and societal structures surrounding AGI. Lastly, from an environmental philosophy point of view, AGI is a double-edged sword. On one hand, it could be a powerful tool in addressing ecological challenges, but on the other, we can't ignore the resource-intensive nature of developing and maintaining such advanced technologies. It's a delicate balancing act between harnessing AGI for good 
and not tipping the ecological balance even further. So, whether AGI is seen as a breakthrough or a threat largely depends on how you look at it. It's a topic that's not just about technology or science, it's deeply rooted in our philosophical beliefs and values. This makes the discourse around AGI diverse, complex, and absolutely fascinating. If you've made it this far, comment down below with the word 100% to confirm that you've received the knowledge from this video. For more interesting topics, make sure you watch the recommended video that you see on the screen right now. Thanks for watching.